permit. Yeah, good afternoon, Christina. If you may remember, the Alario site was used for quite a while during the first surge of COVID-19 here in Jefferson Parish as a way to mitigate the spread. Well, starting Monday, August 16th, it will look like it did last year with another mass testing site set up right here. And the reason is because of the big spike in COVID cases that we've seen in the parish. They're also seeing 200 to 300 people a day at their smaller site, which is nearby Harold McDonald Park. Now, just like last year, the National Guard will be manning this location, according to the President Chang. And healthcare officials also stress that their hospital systems they are really overwhelmed. Like you mentioned, healthcare is no longer a luxury for people. And the president, she said she was very direct and, and visibly frustrated while delivering today's news, not just because of the community spread, but also because of the low vaccination rates we're seeing in Jefferson and hearing a lot of complaints and people not wanting to wear masks, according to the state mandates. And that that's the two best levels of protection against spreading this virus right now. I will never understand why this is such a big deal, given the situation we're in where our hospitals are bursting at the seams. I will never get that, why this little thing over your face is such a big deal to people. It's not. Again, this testing site, mass testing site at the Alario Center, this will reopen on Monday, August 16th. It's open to all residents, regardless if they're Jefferson Parish residents or not. Coming up at 4 p.m., we're going to hear more from the officials on what they had to say, stressing this message to protect each other. And also, we're going to hear from some businesses on how they've been impacted as well. Reporting from Jefferson, Sherman DeSalle, WDSU News. All right, Sherman, thank you. Let's go ahead and give you a live look out.